Often at dusk, the Tokyo sky shows traces of ink. For some, a night of drawing begins. Sometimes a Hokusai album is at hand for checking a detail or for unravelling the mystery of lines. As a homage, Hokusai has been featured as the protagonist of many a manga. The eye links all illustrators from past to present, present to past. And we are invited to see with that eye. Hokusai was born in 1760, and his works still feel contemporary today. He worked in the Edo period, which lasted from 1603 to 1868, during which foreigners were not admitted into Japan and Japanese were not allowed to travel abroad. The capital was Edo, which grew into today's Tokyo. Central power lay in the hands of the shogun. There are no photos because due to this isolation, photography arrived late in Japan. Hokusai's father was a mirror craftsman. He found an apprenticeship for his 13-year-old son in an engraving shop. At 19, Hokusai decided he wanted to be an artist. He chose to become a student of Edo's Grand Master of Woodblock Prints. Hokusai learned fast, and he would never stop learning. This is thought to be his first work, an engraving of a famous kabuki actor. His joy in describing the variety of life itself had only just begun. Twenty-nine years old, sumo wrestlers, woodblock print. Thirty-three years old, silhouettes to cut out and stick on the picture of an actor. Thirty-eight years old, an ancient turtle, ink, colors, gopher, and slivers of gold on paper. 40 years old, landscape with bridge at the foot of the hills, woodblock print. 49 years old, a beauty standing and tying her obi, colors and gofen on silk. 51 years old, carp and turtles, ink and colors on paper. 57 years old, tiger and bamboo in the light of the full moon, colors on silk. 64 years old, single brush stroke painting, woodblock print. 69 years old, a lesson in sand painting, woodblock print. 